Hey guys, everybody, it's Blood No 3. Welcome to Kingdom Hearts 2 Breathe. In the last episode, we did stuff. This time, we're gonna go do some more stuff. Like opening a chest. And talking to Donald. And fixing my brightness while you're being distracted. And opening another chest. And investigating what this guy's doing. I got it. These are like the easiest enemy ever. You will have no trouble with them and they only drop 2p. We're already done with it. Look at that. And in case you're wondering, all those items drop, all those items are dropped everywhere. Also known as Gandalf. Jim Sid is the king's teacher. Wow, sounds powerful. <laughs> Just completely ignoring. So what I was saying before our cutscene <clears throat> is that any items door any any item orbs that drop during the battle will be collected at the end of battle. But as you saw out there, we can't go out there. So I missed the chest. Yeah. 
Mr. Guy. I'm probably just gonna speed up the times on the stairways between then and now. Because it's pretty much it's just the small rooms that are technically part of the actual game. The stairs can be completely ignored, but these can't, so I'll keep them in the video. And the magic of editing in five, four, three, two, another two, <laughs> another two, haha, <laughs> one. One. That's the magic of editing right there. Here's our first night. I don't remember the terminology correctly, but I know these at least are shadows. Ow. You know, Donald is right there, so why can't he just teach us magic? And there you see us collecting up all the months and health. That's what I call my girlfriend. Haha, <laughs> I don't have one at this point in time. So the worlds aren't at peace after all? Three, two, one, editing. Ooh, there's our first, uh, um, of an item, uh, material. You collect these, the random drops from enemies, that was a dark shard that's used for odd crafting. finding my friend Riku, so we could go back to the islands. Sorry, but they're destroyed. I know. However, everything in your journey, Sora, <coughs> is connected. Whether you will find your way home to the islands, whether you will return alone or with your friend, and whether or not the islands will still be there. Called it. And the key that connects them all is the you, The key. Sora. I'm... the key? Yeah, that means the key wields... the key wields a key. <sighs> Chosen wielder of the key blade. Who is a key? You are the key that yep. will open the door to light. Wow. I can be quite sarcastic. I hope that doesn't bother you. <coughs> oh, look at 
at that, it's a book. This book contains valuable knowledge you will need for your journey. Study it carefully. Once you have finished, we will speak of the enemies you will surely confront. People are gonna dislike me whether I read it or not, so I'm going to speed up all of this to maximum speed. And I'll see you in a minute. Alright, I hope that wasn't too long. You can, um, <clears throat> usually if you're browsing on the computer or a few other things, you can slow down the video. Actually, dot dot dot. But wait a sec, how come the Heartless are still running around? Your past endeavors did prevent an immense effusion of Heartless from the Great Darkness. Make no mistake about that. However, the Heartless are darkness made real, and darkness yet lingers in every heart. The Heartless are fewer, but while darkness exists in a single heart, it will be difficult to eliminate them. Gorge, that was mean. If everybody's heart um, was full of light, uh, then heart government. would go away. Now, it is time to speak of the enemies that you will encounter. That'll get rid of the darkness. <laughs> A duck! Take it down! A heartless! Kill it! If one such as you, Donald, yields to the darkness in their heart. You will become a level they one scrub. You will become a heartless. Yay. But you know this. <coughs> the heartless are always lurking and ever seeking to capture new hearts. Never let your guard down. Now then. Dusk. At times. If someone with a strong heart and will, be they evil or good, becomes a heartless, the empty shell they leave behind begins to act with a will of its own. An empty vessel whose heart has been stolen away. A spirit that goes on, even as its body fades from existence. For you see, no bodies do not truly exist at all. No bodies may seem to have feelings, but this is a ruse. They only pretend to have hearts. You must not be deceived. No bodies. They don't exist. Now then, the being you see before you is known as a dusk. They are the most common form of nobody. But there are others, some larger, some with frightening and unique powers. Be vigilant. Yeah, I've seen a few of those. On your journey, you will meet an alarming number of dust. At least five. We'll all attempt to do you harm. Except Gerald. You can you just forget about their own. I don't kill him anyways, but... empty shells destined to return to darkness, but... <gasps> the beings you see before you now are different. These powerful nobodies have formed a group called Organization 13. They have Command actual faces. The lesser nobodies. Yeah. Organization 13. And they're all lesser nobodies. All of them. Except the Organization 